Hey guys, welcome to new comic book pick video. Tell me comics picked up. Got a shit ton of comics here. Uh, I just picked all these up this weekend. Look at all these comics. Comic, comic, comics. It's, like over, it's almost 50 comics here. We gotta get through this. Look at me. Clearly, if we look quickly, but it's gonna tend to be long. You know why? A lot of comics to go through. Let's show. Into it, most of these for a dollar less. Well, all the ones I'm gonna show first are for a dollar. Uh, the Avengers Force Coast 72. Need that for my collection. Like that. And there's Deep Walker issue 3. Didn't have this one, so I was happy to pick that up. Uh, they also had Ghost Rider issue 20, 42. Or uh, the Road to Vengeance the Missing Link. Another one did not have, so I'm happy to get that. Uh, they have one issue of Pencil War Show, another issue 20. The other one for my run of the series, so i happy to get that. Uh, they also had Punisher. Issues 47 and 64. Didn't ever do these, so I had to pick those up and add it to that collection. Like Punisher, so that's awesome. They had uh, What If the Punisher family hadn't been killed? This is 10 on What If. It'd be cool to get that. I'm excited to read that. Also, excited to read this. It says, What If Captain America? And if you open it up, it says, I like the one if in the. It says, in the, What if Captain America was not the only super soldier in World War II? Really cool book, and it does seem to continue on to the next issue, so that's cool. Uh, got two issues of this, which was cool, they had these. A Dead Other Man was out for you, issue two, Frank Miller, and issue five. I need these to complete my run of this. Uh, I'm only missing issue one now, and I have a clear on that, so that's gonna be cool. I can find that. Um, also got Flash 68. Really cool to get that. Like Flash, so. But Mark Ward, gotta pick it up. Uh, they had this, the Lobo Convention Festival, I'll pick that for a dollar. I've been wanting to read more Lobo, so that's cool. They also had this, Lobo's back, the one. Look cool, I like the cover, it's just going to be just for more true readers. Then you open it up. Aha, another cover says, uh, something, it's like, really, strongly suggested for mature readers. And it's like, and you're going to look at it, and it says, look at this, it's like, so, put it back, kids. I'm like, yeah, these are not going to be kids. Uh, this is a mature comic, and yes, this should be. It's so mature. Like this is a mature, mature comic. And could you not be reading it? Next comic I got, I got two of them. Got two of them. Two in a bag. They went a bag together. Batman Adventures number six. I got. They were both in a bag together, so I just so they could get counted as one. So that's a dollar for those. So that's cool. They were cool to get. Found these two. Probably two of the blue cards I got from this booth. Uh, Green Lantern and Green Lantern issue 99 and 109, but cool. It was cool that this, this is when Green Arrow was doing Green Lantern was doing the thing with Green Arrow, so doing a crossover series. But like it was both of them, so that's pretty cool to get those. They don't have any of those, but that's pretty cool to get. Uh, also got some I like regular Green Arrow stuff. Got issue 10, didn't have that. That was nice. And I got the first annual Green Arrow. Little book didn't have for dollar. All okay for. Next we have some Batman stuff. Got a bunch of Batman stuff. Here, Batman Free 98. It was cool. That's an older issue. Also Free 99. Another super older issue. Uh, then we got Batman issue 414. That's the one they had the new adventures on it. Uh, Batman 416. Another one didn't have. Cool. Uh, Batman uh, 441 was probably the only place of dying part. I was the part four. No, part three. Part three. And then we got Batman, the 448, depending on the fail, part one. That's cool. We got a bunch of Batman stuff. Cool. And we got some more stuff. Uh, the last stuff we got from that group was more Batman stuff, but it's a different series. We have Detective Comics 606. People get that. Detective Comics 611. Didn't have that. 615 was the Ping on the Fail part two. Be cool. Detective Comics 617, awesome, and 658 was the first, this is right before uh, the next issue after this one, is when Nightfall starts, this is right before Nightfall, so let's get that. Oh, they got from that boost, so for a dollar, the next comic I got, the one was 75 cents a piece, is Black Orchid number 8, number 10, got these for 75 cents a piece, not too bad, a little less than a dollar, so happy with that. I think that one wants a dollar. Suzanne, I'm in the beginning of issue 3. It's a dollar. Pretty cool to get that one. I'm missing issue 2 now for that. Uh, we have the new Future N. 
Uh, 52 that would also I think a dollar or 75 cents so that would be awesome to get that. I do 48 for that. I'll get a Warming Origins issue 9 on one of the cool books I got because I like Warming Origins and also another time you like this uh, one so you can find a page. See if I can find a good page here to show this off. You can't tell. It has awesome Steve Dillon on so I always I totally forgot he grew to being on this so that's awesome. That was only 50% because it's not in the best condition, but it's fine. I definitely want to think a dollar as well. Fits as an all star. I think that one might have been a dollar fifty, maybe. Let me look here. I think that one's dollar fifty, but fits as an all star part two. Issue six. I'm like, yes, I'm going to read more fists of being all star comics. So I was like, yes, this is one I'm definitely going to be picking up that into my collection. Awesome. And we got uh, some Astro City comics. And that's what the. So this is right here. After City Comics, got some of the ones I was missing. They had issue 7, one of the ones I was talking about in a later video, that I needed. I also had issue 16, another one I needed. And these two I wasn't sure. I got issue 18, what I needed. But I also got issue 19, because I wasn't sure if I need this. Actually, I already have, but I'm just going to install that one next to the video. Ooh, we can do a big stack here. Then we got the Astro City, the Dark Ages book 1, issue 2. Didn't have that, so now it's a cool Astro City book to get. And the last stuff I got was this. I'm gonna probably I got this poster from the same vendor. I had some posters. Yeah, this I had to pick it up. If anyone knows I'm a Spider-Man fan, I had to pick it. Anyway, I had this poster. I had to pick it up. It's cool. Spidey Gwen poster. What is cool? It is Marvel Spider Gwen. Also, I really like the art style on this one. Let's see you like it. That's cool. Those three bucks probably the most expensive thing I got. Um, that was the most expensive thing I got, and I'm trying to fold it back. Uh, I need to fold it if I can back to the way it was. I don't know how this folds back together with like this. So if I'm trying to fold this back up, make sure I get this all right. Uh, it seems like I'm getting it right. And do we do do we do. Fold it back up, it holds up really nice. So that's cool for you Last comics, uh, all, all old to use all dollar news I got about one, two, three, four, five, six. These are all old comics, so this is what we can get. Found this old Phantom Strange issue 28. Really awesome to get. It came out in 1973 slash 74. It also had the Spawn of Frankenstein comic in it. That's pretty cool for a dollar. Also got Phantom Strange issue 79. I think it was in the same year. 1975. Another one was him teaming up with, uh, he teamed up with uh, Dead Man Dickman and also had a a black orchid comic in the back, so that's pretty cool. So for a dollar, that's cool. I also found that Commandi as it's the last boy on Earth issue 13 by the great uh, Jack Kirby. Awesome to get that. Also, they had Mr. Miracle issue 18 with the last issue for this one. Another Jack Kirby awesomeness, so I had to pick that up for a dollar. And then I found Swamp Thing issue 9, uh, issue 8 for a dollar. I'll pick that up. And then Werewolf by Night issue 40. Awesome to pick this up and a really good book to enjoy and awesome stuff. So yeah. But Marvel. The old book. These were not in the best condition. But some of these were in okay condition like the um, uh, the one that was in the best condition I think was the uh through the commodity I understand. It was in pretty good condition and the one time of change was in pretty decent condition. Uh, let me look at the other fan trains. So that one was in okay condition. Uh, the off by night and the Quamps, I think, are in the worst condition. Because the miracle was a little damaged, but pretty much okay. The rest of these were. Yeah, okay, so I got these six old EO comic books, and they are awesome. I got these six old comic books here. So, on so the screen, we have some or something. Yeah, I don't know, but I don't really have some now, but who knows? I'm probably going to take that out if I decide to. But yeah, that's it for the video, guys. You can like, feel to be subscribe for more videos on this channel. Comic book and video game and toy related. You can always check out my main channel. Super cool to go on where I do parodies, get some stuff on that channel. Check out social media, Facebook, and Twitter, and all stuff in the description below. You can always get back up to you, guys. Push it